I'm here with Dr. Romano to do a problem on gas laws. Hi, I'm Dr. Romano. I'm professor of organic chemistry here at Romano Scientific and the creator of the Orgo Man and Death Destroyer books. I'd like to go over a question with you on the gas laws, which are a very important part of the deck. Don't worry about the numbers not being nice. On the DAT as well as the destroyer, the numbers will be much easier to work with. For this video, I want you to make sure you understand the concepts and how to approach the problem. So come, come around and let's have a look. I say to you, we have one times 10 to the fifth liters of hydrogen and it is held in a container at one atmosphere and 23 Celsius. What is the mass of the hydrogen? The minute I hear the word gases and mass, the equation I'm gonna most likely use is PV equals NRT. The R is OA21, that's gonna be given to you on the DAT, so don't worry about that. So we're gonna plug in them. The pressure is in atmosphere, so it's one. We know the volume, there's the R. You have to add 273 to the 23 to get 296. I know the numbers aren't so nice, but we get 41, 15 moles of hydrogen. And all I simply do is to convert moles of hydrogen into grams, and I get 8230 grams, which is approximately 8.2 times 10 to the third grams. So that's simple enough. You should be able to hit a question like that with ease. B, what is the volume of hydrogen at STP? Now, you should remember that at STP, the pressure is 1 atm and the temperature is 273 Kelvin. So what I'm gonna do is plug in, the pressure is one, we don't know the V. The moles we already found, the moles doesn't change. Um, once you change the temperature, which we have before, we found it at 23 degrees at 298, versus 273, it would be the same number of moles. So that doesn't change. There's the R, there's the 273, and that gives me 92,231 liters, or 9.2 to the fourth liters. Part C, at what pressure will the volume equal 25 liters if the temperature is held at 23 Celsius and one to the fifth liters? Well, anytime you get a problem, and this is a guaranteed DAC question involving pressures and temperatures and volumes, you're gonna say P1, V1 over T1 equals P2, V2, T2. Now, it says that the temperature is constant, meaning it's being held. So that means these cancel. So we got P1, V1 is P2, V2. I hope you recognize P1, V1 equals P2, V2 as Boyle's law. This is Boyle's law, and we plug in, we don't know the pressure, but it says the volume at this pressure was 25. Then at 23 Celsius, which we know is constant, we have one to the fifth liters, and we're at the pressure, if you go back to the problem, was one atmosphere, so the pressure was one, the volume is one to the fifth, so we're gonna take this and divide it out, and we get 4,000, which is four to the third atmospheres. This is a problem I did many years ago with my AP chemistry class, and I thought I'd share it with you. All right, hope this helps, and I'll see you in study group. Bye-bye.